everybody, so it's me Rachel, and tonight I've decided to make a video, even though the sun has gone down long ago. Um, I went shopping today with my children at the local Goodwill, and it seems like their prices have gone up a little bit lately. Um, in fact, I know they have. I've, I've heard other people talking about it too. And the funny thing is, they're not selling out as fast, so they've got these big huge bins full of stuff outside, just waiting to be... Um, put on the shelves but people can't afford to pay you know like eight dollars for a shirt and stuff so hopefully their prices go back down a little at the same time I know their bills are going up because everyone's bills are going up inflation sucks um first item I got is a toaster and I did not get one of the higher the one of the better brand name ones I just got I don't know if it's good or not it's Fractor Silex cool touch I got it because it was wider than the other ones. My other um, toaster finally hit the dust, and so I bought another one for $2.99. Let's see how long this one lasts. The last one lasted for, I think, two years. Um, second thing I got was for my son. He picked it out. This was $4.99, and he's been wanting to do a little different experiments at home. So I thought this was a cool little kit, and he was really anxious to try it out. Um, this is a book my little guy picked out. It's 99 cents. It's just one of the school bus books. And I can't say no, no anytime my son asks for another educational book, which is why I have way too many books. That one was $2.99. What we went in there for was to look for jackets and boots because we had our first snow today. I woke up and the ground was covered with snow. My vehicle is covered with snow. Um, we still have two pieces of roofing to put on that we're waiting on Lowe's for. Um, and the hills tonight still have snow. It didn't melt on the hills or the mountaintops or anything. It's still up there. And I wasn't able to find very many jackets yet because it's still a little bit early in the season but also because everyone is wanting one. So I ended up paying $5.99 for a jacket for Robbie. See that? It's a cute one. He looks very handsome in it. Um, oh, before I forget, I got this. It's still in the box, but I opened up the box to make sure it was all good. It's a cake plate. Um, you can also use it as a punch bowl. I thought since I love entertaining people with food, that this is perfect for me. You can serve cake at family functions, you know, birthday parties, holiday parties, church, whatever. Um, I'm a sucker for skirts, so my first item it was yellow tag day, which means everything with a yellow tag was half off. This one was $5.99 originally, so that was like $3. And it's a nice long one. A little bit rumpled, but... Let's see. It'll reach to my toes. And these comfy PJ pants also came from the Goodwill. And I don't remember how much they were. They were a few dollars, I think. Second skirt. This one was $3.99. I should be doing a little fashion show. This one I really love. Because I think it'll only probably reach my knees. And it's just fun and twirly. I love fun and twirly stuff. This is a cute little summer dress. It was $2.00. It was half off, and it's strapless. It was in with the skirts, and I think it could easily go for a skirt, but I'm nearly positive it's actually a dress because, yeah, it is. Just watch why. I don't know if you can see that or not, but yeah, it's pretty clearly a dress. Um, I bought Madeline some shoes. They were two fifty. They'll go good at church. And Madeline got a pair of gloves for three dollars also. So we did find some some winter stuff and then I, I'm not really sure who threw in the 99 cent pairs of gloves. I think those are like 99 cents anywhere you go though. So not a perfect deal. And Elizabeth got shoes for they're a dollar fifty. And I don't know. They don't look very used though. They look really shiny white, so they couldn't be too used. If used at all. Um, this is a little gift. It wasn't too much, but I was willing to pay anything they had on it because 
It's awesome. It's a gift for somebody who sent me a package um, off of YouTube. So I better not give her name or anything or talk about the price. Plus, it looks like my kids took the price off anyway. But it's made out of stone. I think it's just really beautiful. Here. And then I found Madeline pants. Madeline needs pants because she's been growing like a weed. First pair is just like some skinny jeans here. They're $3.99. Second pair of pants, another pair of jeans. Hopefully these are long enough, they're size seven. This pair was only two dollars. Um, this this is a skinny pair. This is this stretches a lot though. In fact, I think they used to stretch on her until she's 14. They're just $1.99. This was a product that I got to resell because it is Genuine leather. It's got a good brand name here. It was only um, five dollars because it was half off today. A pair of binoculars, three dollars. I'm hurrying up because my battery's dying. I don't know where any more batteries are. These are two dollar jeans from Madeline. So okay, next jeans for her, and a pair of nice, yeah, another pair of tight pants. These were only a dollar for Madeline. Okay, so I think I think that was about it on my thrift store haul. Oh, I also got a desk, but yeah, it's just for easy to do school. I probably see it in another video at some point. It was twelve ninety nine, and then I got a bag when I was dumpster diving. But I'm pretty sure my battery's gonna die before I can go through that with you. I can tell you, first product I found in it was these it's glitter glue pins. I'm looking forward to going through it. It's like an adventure going through those bags. I got some gloves and I can try to go through it before the battery's dead. Oh, there's the desk. So I'm just going to put on some of my work gloves. And here's something to recycle. If you ever find these, you just recycle them. I find all kinds of stuff to recycle. And there's always a little thing maker too. So, two good things at once. Recycling. pumpkin. What the heck is this? Lava putty. It's not opened. It looks like it got squished a little maybe. Oh look! That's what it is. I can rinse that off. It's a kit for making a big pumpkin. My kids will love that. I'll just have to rinse that off because it looks like it fell down in some way. That's on it. doesn't really look like this is a great find, but I haven't been finding it as much lately. So I was happy to find anything. I bet this is some kind of bag I could use for storing chicken feed in. I can use. Bye now for now. Thanks for watching.